just a straight up fight, but I doubt that this one that that is going um going to happen. Kind of intriguing there there are there is no siege mode. Um and there are quite a few tanks uh looking like he's going for another complete marine drop. Um Sen is going to notice that the Thor ship is coming back over. Uh, he's, he is reacting, he's bringing back a whole bunch of troops. Uh, this time though, that Thor is going to do more damage because of all the marines accompanying it. Yeah, definitely. So those marines position themselves kind of around the Thors, but a lot of roaches there, and yeah, looks like Mark. oh no, he screwed up when he was trying to, oh, wow, really nice job here from Sen, he's going to fungal growth these medevacs and get a few infestors down, and yeah, Maka kind of forced to drop there. Yeah, that's going to be completely, uh, mopped up. Now, as you were mentioning, the Thor uh, couldn't get back in because a few marines had been loaded up in one, and of course, a Thor takes an entire medevac. Sen has taken the gold. He's also retaking uh, his third, and looks like Maka Prime is moving right in the center. He has his tank sieged up, and he's going to be doing a tank crawl uh, towards his opponent's base. Yep, so just doing a bit of a slow push over here. Getting up all those tanks inside of the smoke. This is pretty nice because that watchtower gives them the uh, range that they need, or the site that they need, to utilize their um, range to their fullest. A lot of roaches now moving in. Where are the marines? Okay, the marines are still there. They need to get to a better position to defend those tanks, though. I like how they're spread out, so if they take any friendly fire from tanks, they won't be hit as much. Uh, Manga knows that he can't really attack that head-on, so he's attacking the, the rocks in, right in the middle. That's going to allow him to bypass this giant tank line because you never want to attack directly into one. Yeah, and the marine spread near these uh, tanks also kind of prevent, not really prevents, but it makes the fungal growth a lot less efficient. Oh, you're absolutely correct. Maka does realize that the rocks are being taken down, gets a few shots in, uh, gets a few tanks in position. He's actually retreating his entire force. Oh, Ooh, left the tank behind. A lot of roaches. But yeah, there are a huge number of roaches, 55 in fact, and Maka looks like he might be attacking through the middle now, uh, having unseized all those tanks. Um, he, where is he going? Uh, looks like he's just going to go and defend. That third base is up. I wouldn't be surprised. Oh. It's a planetary fortress, and he's moving. Roaches are now moving in to attack that, that new expansion. Yeah, canceling the planetary fortress upgrade and now lifting off. But oh man, so many roaches over here and some infestors. If he can get some good fungal growth, he might be able to take this battle and then the game. Great fungal growth on a lot of the marines and a few of the tanks, but it looks like there's just too many tanks. That splash damage really slaughtering these roaches. Yeah, with a plus one attack, they do 55 damage versus armor, and of course, all those roaches are armored. Uh, gonna deny that, that other mining base again, but Sen himself, uh, he doesn't even have anything mining down at the gold, and he's got still a large number of tanks, which are crucial in that last battle, and of course all these marines that are getting healed up. Yeah, and Sen also healing up some of his roaches by burrowing them. He's got another 19 in production, he's getting um, armor 2 for those roaches. He's not really producing, well, attacking too much, he's just kind of content to stay on this Infestor Roach build for his army. We see a sensor tower now going down here for Maka Prime, so he will be able to defend this a lot better. Yeah, it confuses me just a tiny bit. Uh, I mean, against all these Marines, I would have imagined he would have complemented these with, uh, with Banelings. Setting up another nice tank line at the middle. He's trying to go for a flank here with Roaches on both sides. Fungal growth going down. They've been infested Terrans by the tanks. Uh, looks like these tanks actually are going to go down here. All these roaches are going to be able to clean up. Yeah, still a lot of roaches left and not much left for Maka. There are a few sieged up tanks, so he's going to lose a few more roaches over here. But he should be... Oh, no, more reinforcements. A lot of Marines coming in, and Sand is going to be forced to back off. Yeah, he can't attack that, that uh, third expansion because the planetary force is up. Uh... And yeah, forcing those reaches, roaches to uh, to fall back, regroup, um, and now more tanks again taking uh, the the Zaldaga watchtower. Yeah, oh man, scanning the burrowed roaches, this, this tank able to put out a lot of damage over here. Looks like Maka is going to lose his marine force, and that means that his tank force is also going to go down. Streaming in with a few more reinforcements, but oh wow, he's doing a really nice job against all these roaches. 
yeah, this is just like edge of your seat action. Uh, you know, more more Marines, more, uh, more roaches. 17, 20 roaches in production. Like, coming from the back, uh, yeah, taking out some of the tanks in behind. Looks like these roaches will be able to get some damage done, and uh, Mach is moving in to defend this from his front. Bunker full of Marines, uh, but it looks like Sam might be content. Oh, he'll just attack that head on. More roaches streaming through the middle. And all of his tanks, or Maka's tanks, are down by the Planetary Fortress, and there's just so many roaches right now, and nothing really to stop them for the moment. There are no uh, sieged up tanks or anything here. Yeah, it looks like Sen is actually, or sorry, um, Maka didn't raise his depots in time. The roaches are able to get inside of his main, and there's a lot of them. They're going to be able to destroy all these SCVs, and we might be seeing GG soon. Yeah, I don't think there's much that Maka can do at this point. Uh, he's still not even bringing up his tanks from his expo. Um, and these roaches are going completely wild. They're just taking everything else. And Maka Prime calling good guy game and saying the Muslim had played well. Or sorry, Sen had played well. Yep, so Sen gonna take that. Two games to one.